Hey, what's going on YouTube? UA Reviews here, and today I want to show you guys my Arkansas Razorback Revel Speed football helmet. So, I got this when I went to a Razorback game this year. They had them in the uh, the fan store, or the uh, Razorback Hog Heaven store, if, I'm, if I have any, if I know of any people that ever go to the games, but um, they had these there, and um, I have been going to Razorback games for a long time, and when they do have these type of helmets, or any helmets that are game used, or have been, uh, you know, given, you know, for the fans to buy from the athletic department, uh, these helmets go quick. You know, I have some of the jerseys, you know, I've got numerous jerseys everywhere um, that are game used, but the helmets, uh, they're pretty rare to find. Um, I paid $350 for this, and it's a, <laughs> a lot of money, but, you know, uh, when I was there, I thought that, you know what, they may not ever have these again, and the white helmet, um, which they just unveiled this year uh, with their new jersey designs, and uh, it's really neat. Um, you can kind of tell it has like a, a it kind of fades to a darker gray color on the back, uh, and it kind of goes along with their... Uh, it almost would look cool if they come out with their uh, black jerseys, but as you can tell on the bottom of the helmet, it kind of uh, gets darker, which is kept pretty neat. Um, there's not much, I mean, wear. There's, I mean, I can't. They didn't have, I haven't figured out if these were used in practice or anything, or what. But uh, this helmet is missing a few things. Like normally, like this will say hogs up here, so I'm just guessing this was probably used in practice, and they just. Uh, let the players, or I mean, they just uh, let the fans buy these. Um, another thing that's kind of dri driving me crazy right now is this uh, metal piece here. I can't actually take this off. I have to have a special screwdriver. Uh, this, this type of screw here uh, only tightens. Uh, you can't actually take it off. You have to have a special kind of screwdriver. Uh, it's called a one-way. Um, I need like a one. I mean, it's called a one-way screwdriver. I need one of those. Um, so I'm gonna be in, try to look and see if I can find one, so I can maybe put this on my head. Um, it is a large, um, and as you can tell, it's a, it's got the seal there. It's got the little thing. It says it was for the 2012 season, so it's been certified as you know. It's a good helmet to use. Uh, it's got a white face mask on it, kind of like a uh, just a basic looking face mask. Um, I am probably looking to get a visor to put on this, um, probably an Under Armour one. Um, the Razorbacks are sponsored by Nike. Um, if you have an old Nike visor you wanted to donate to me, uh, I'd be willing to maybe give you some kind of Under Armour product. If you'd send me a, your old Nike visor or something, that'd be kind of cool, just to make it Nike, just so it's like the Razorbacks. Um, so yeah, that's just a thought though. Um, I do plan to try to get like uh some decals put on this like i know that on the razorbacks the real one it says hogs up here um and then it says arkansas on the back or it says razorbacks where it says Rydell. um and then the inside of it i believe like you know on some of the rebel speeds uh, they actually have like the black lining i think i may look to get the actual black lining i can tell that's probably been taken out and from what the people told me that i bought this from they did take all that out uh, just so they could sell it like that, and I guess they keep their black linings for the athletic department. But uh, it's a pretty neat helmet. Um, I was really excited to get this. I'm a Razorback fan, um, and I mean, you can't give me any crap for what we're going through this year because it's terrible. Um, one in four right now. Um, but anyway, I mean, this was just something really cool, and I always, I've probably said this before, I've been looking to get a helmet. Uh, little newer designed helmet and I got it so um, it's a really cool piece to add to my kind of like collection um, so yeah pretty neat um, like I said if you want to donate your old Nike visor um, Nike football visor uh, if you've got an old scratched up one I'd be willing to take it um, and I might I'll probably give you something like Under Armour in, in return or something so or even if you have an Under Armour one you don't want anymore, I would take that. Um, and I might trade you something. But uh, 
that's just a thought though like i said but anyway uh i guess i'm gonna wrap this video up now uh, you might see some more you probably see some more with this helmet in the future i'll probably get uh be able to review like a chin strap on it if i can get like a uh um, a snap i've got one snap here a high one but i've got to get that thing took taken off so i can do a have a snap for the bottom so i've got a lot of work to do with this helmet make it kind of look pretty cool and i do plan to uh make it kind of neat and if i have any if i do anything to it i'll be sure to update you guys on it so thanks for watching guys and just make sure to subscribe to ua reviews for more football videos on football reviews and whatnot so uh i guess we'll see you guys next time thanks for watching